one of the things which sort of ties all Burns' songs together is actually the, is the fact that the tunes are mainly from the fiddle repertoire. He found the melody first uh, somewhere on his travels, and then the, the melody would suggest uh, an emotion or, a, or paint a picture for him uh, in his head, and then he would proceed to put a lyric to it uh, till the two things became this sort of homogenous song. The songs are very difficult to sing because because of the very fact that Burns took them from fiddle tunes and they were never intended to be sung to in the first place. And so uh, sometimes it's very hard to sing one of the Burns songs uh, that had been written to fiddle melodies because the fiddle sometimes jumps octaves and very, so you have to have sometimes a very large range in your singing to, to do that. Burns was very lucky to, to meet and uh, and hear the music of people like William Marshall and particularly uh, Neil Gow. And uh, coming from Dunkeld myself, I, I can understand why Burns couldn't help be moved and uh, influenced. And this tune was the original inspiration for Burns to write uh, My Love Is Like A Red Red Rose. Although it's not the melody which we now know the song to, but it was the melody that created the original inspiration for him to, to write this beautiful song.